in last night's win for the Crusaders. Isaac battling for the puck in behind the Crusaders goal. Isaac still with it. Plays it out in front for White. He shoots. He scores! 22 seconds into the hockey game. It's Jared White blasting home a goal past Zach Klassen and the youngsters strike first. And you can just tell how the team came out today. They were fired up this first line. The rookies, they have something to prove after a fantastic night last night. Tom Tekka gave them the start. 22 seconds, a dream start for the Oil Barons. Up 1-0. The Crusaders penalty kill 8th at 81.7% so far on the year. And here come the Crusaders, short and it is Rebelato. Cross ice for Zahara Chuck, and the game is tied. Oil Barons lose the faceoff, and the Crusaders come flying up the ice on a two-on-one, and it's Darcy Zaharichuk ripping a shot past Sudor off a great feed from Ryan Rebelato. And I think it was about 15 seconds ago that I said the Barons have to find a way to keep this momentum. Last night, they gave up three straight goals after getting the one nothing lead. They allow a, a shorthanded goal 11 seconds into their power play. They got to find a way to rebound and get back in this one now. McKintree gets the line through the middle, finds Ursulak. Edwards heads towards the front of the goal. Ursulak curls back. Wood sends a shot and deflected in front. They score! What a feed from Stephen Wood. He saw Jackson McKinstry atop the crease. The deflection was stopped, but the rebound was not. And the Oil Barons strike again. It's 2-1. to one. We talk about the injuries to the Oil Barons, and you bring up Kobe Shatler, a physical guy. They bring in a guy like Stephen Wood yesterday, laying the body all over, had a couple good opportunities. Just flicked one towards the net here, picked up on the rebound. If you're looking at Zach Klassen, he's shaking his head. He's going to want to get that one back. And he gets played out towards the face-off circle. Alger cross-ice to Tubic comes down. He snaps a shot. Up high on class, and it's Weeks throw, and they score! Ryan Cox pounces on that loose puck in the crease as it squeaked right under the arm of Klassen. And the Oil Barons lead 3-1, to one and the game's not even five minutes old. Just about five minutes ago, I talked about the Barons have to find a way to exploit the Crusaders' defense that is depleted now with Cameron Regan. And just like that, Zach Klassen is going to go to the bench. He had a fantastic game yesterday other than that third goal by the Barons. But now it's going to be up to Morrissey if the Crusaders want to get back in this game. Terrible start for the Crusaders. Just four minutes and 46 seconds in. To the other side now. He goes through the middle and finds Ryan Rebelato. Rebelato with speed and Zaharichuk. It's another two-on-one and a diving effort from Wood. Breaks up that... Zaharichuk off the bench. He gets ridden into the end wall by Wood and Miller again. And he can't believe it. Tanner Miller is back to the penalty box as Stefan Wood and Zaharichuk. Thomas finds Ty Reedman on the right wing. Zaharichuk heads towards the goal. It's Dykstra coming in late down to Zaharichuk in a tic-tac-toe passing game for the second game in a row by this line. What a goal by Zaharichuk. The Crusaders really are the best when they're moving the puck quickly. Tic-tac-toe pass, and that is evidence with that absolutely fantastic pass, pass, pass with the goal. Great goal by the Crusaders to get back in this game. To Casal, that one's picked off. Here's Roach. He has speed. Curtis Roach across the line on the back end. Plays it out in front for Cox. What a save by Morrissey. Stephen Bacon in two games, though. White's clearing it. Or dump in, sorry. Hits Roberts. And the Crusaders come the other way as Newman stand. Shot right all the way down the ice to Sudor. He gloves it down. And the mob come away. Here's Ralph down the right side. Ralph dances around Shmorkov. He's in on goal on the back end. Down is Morrissey. Frazier scores! And J. 
Jake Morrissey is going to chase the official around the ice. He is very upset. Shane Frazier finds the loose puck off the rebound from Brandon Ralph and makes this a 4-2 game. It's a power play goal. And I actually haven't seen that very often from Jake Morrissey. He literally skated as fast as he could to keep up with the referee. I don't know if he was hit or not, but at the end of the day, the Barons found a way to get the puck to the back of the net on the power play, and they get their two-goal lead back, 4-2, with three minutes and 50 seconds left, out shooting the team 17-50. Wilson, over to Thomas. Thomas is pass, finds Jesse Zaharachuk. He goes through the middle. It's Reedman. Reedman with room. Wood slides right by him. Reedman tries to get a shot off, but he can't. Now Zaharachuk does, and he scores. Well, it wasn't the way they drew it up, but the Crusaders once again cut the lead to one. A seeing-eye shot from Z Jesse Zaharachuk, and he's got two in the period. Rebound pops out behind the goal. Edwards finds Hamley in the slot. A quick shot. Morrissey makes the save. The rebound. <laughs> On the ice, Malpy has to dance around it. Now he has his stick taken out of his hands from Newman. The oil parents come the other way. Here's Brett Edwards. Driving hard towards the goal, and Morrissey. The backhand, a bouncing one. Roach keeps the line momentarily. Now it's kicked out by a Zitko. A two-on-one shaping out. Merida Zitko in, fires a shot. Big save. The face-off one clean by the Crusaders, but Ralph makes the blockers. Dylan Rao on a breakaway. Rao in on breakaway, score! Starts with the captain and a massive shot block from Brandon Ralph. Dylan Rao scoops up the puck and is away to the races. And he beats Morrissey on the blocker's side and gives the mob a two-goal lead. It's 5-3. to three. And uh, in the pregame show, Tom talked about the commitment of the boys yesterday wasn't there as far as blocking shots, getting down to the dirty areas. You just showed the veteran player, Brendan Ralph, there a fantastic block. It's a stanchion, and the Oil Barons break away. It's Rao down the right side. He'll just dump it in behind the Crusader. Goal as he runs over. Finds the puck. He has some room. Up to McKinstry. McKinstry across center ice. Unselfish play to Frazier. And a diving desperate.